guys, Axel Fireflurry here. I am back from the dead yet again to finally bring you the Pokemon Leaf Green Randomizer Let's Play. So, quick heads up as to why I've been gone since getting the laptop. I've actually been helping a buddy of mine start up his own YouTube channel because he wants to do like storytelling, but his stories, at least to me, don't make sense as a book. They make better narrations like a creepypasta type thing, but not creepypastas. But anyway, so I've been helping him with that, and I've just been getting ready for this week. So let's hop right into this. Alright, we already know all the weird little mechanics, blah 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 blah. So guys, just so you know, I will not be making this a Nuzlocke, and I have randomized just about everything. So we're, I'm just going to talk over Professor Oak, because we all know about this, but anyway. So... Uh, moves are randomized, evolutions are completely randomized, so a uh, Pidgey can evolve into like a Gyarados, or a Pidgey can evolve into an Ivysaur, and then an Ivysaur can evolve into maybe a Teddy Ursa, and then a Teddy Ursa, and so on and so forth. So we're gonna name me after me. Uh, I didn't like the idea of capital, all caps, I mean, so we're gonna go lowercase. And I figured my rival for this Let's Play is going to be another buddy of mine who does a gaming channel. And he's been a good buddy of mine. We do real Pokemon battles every now and again. So I'm just going to name this after him. Uh, his link, the link to his channel is in the description. So we are going to name him uh, Kanyon. He's a good buddy of mine. We grew up together. Uh, we don't live too far apart, so visitation wouldn't be too hard. It's just the schedules that are conflicting. So we're going to name our green or blue, no, or red, whatever. We're going to call him Kanyon, and we're good to go. So guys, I am really, really pumped for Pokemon Sun and Moon this week, and I know uh, pretty much the rest of you are really, really excited for that too, and this weekend's going to be absolutely amazing because Pokemon Sun and Moon come out, the new Harry Potter movie comes out, yes, I'm a Potter nerd. Uh, Hogwarts house is Ravenclaw, my evil morning house, because I do live in the United States, is Thunderbirds. Wand, Rosewood, Phoenix Feather, because I'm freaking legit. Just talk to mom for some weird reason. Hi, mama. Anyway, this is going to be a really awesome weekend. So, back, back to the game at hand. So, let's go activate the Professor Oak event. Don't go out into the woods! It's not safe! But my question is like, how does everyone else who do who don't know Professor Oak like the hundreds of CPUs you battle? Where do they get their Pokemon? Where do they get to like leave their house and their little town without coming to see you to get you know a Pokemon? But that I'm, I'm thinking too into this. So we're we're about to get our our starter. Uh, this is gonna be a bit of a short video purely because I just want to introduce the new uh, the new Let's Play. Uh, Kanyon's being a whiny little bitch. It's okay, I beat him in Pokemon battles all the time. Uh, Clefairy. Ooh, it's an Ice-type Clefairy. Uh, it's a double Dragon Kill. Uh, Zubat. Rock is Zubat. Um, no. Weeping Bell. Flying. Alright, we'll take Weeping Bell. I think he'll have better stats. Now, the stats are randomized, too, so this can be, like, complete ass. So... See Creeping Bell, do you want to give it a name? Mm, uh, I can't think of any really clever names. So let's go to no. Okay. Whatever. I see how it is. You can pick the one that's super effective against me. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, don't know why I glitched right there. Why? Oh, yeah, let's check out my Pokemon really fast. Uh, let's see Weeping Bell. Ooh, flying dark, adamant, okay, not horrible, I guess. Straight up ass, move pool, uh, at least you have one stab, hydro cannon, uh, that's fine, ice mega drain, rock sacred fire, ghost roar, okay, it's not, it's not bad. Um, definitely could be better, let's grab that lemonade really fast, because I will probably need as much health as humanly possible. And Connor, Connell's gonna do his thing, he's gonna wanna challenge me, and you know, let's bring it on, bro. Bring it on, I will punch you right in the Yava. Send out your Zubat. I don't care. I don't care. Oh my 
god. I, okay, worst part of the Pokemon game. I'm gonna teach you how to battle. Oak, um, no. I, I am a veteran. I am a veteran. I do not need you to teach me how to do this shit. Natural cure? Okay, that's, that's, that's nothing. Bubble? Okay. Zubat, rock. Rock Zubat with bubble. Okay, super effective? That did nothing. Hydro Cannon? Um, I misclicked. I will openly admit that. That did nothing. That did literally zero. That didn't do shit. Um, alright, so I'm in a tough situation. Uh, oh shit, I forgot I have to recharge. There's no justice. There is none. No. This isn't okay. Uh, uh, you know what? No, we're okay. We're okay. We can do this. Mega Dre. Mega Dre. Do this. Let's do this. Oh, and we get the crit. Yes. That crit did nothing. That did not heal me. That didn't. I mean, I'm in a better situation, but no. No. Low roll. No. No. It's, it's okay. We got this. We got this. We won. We won. We have like no health, but we won. Zubat, suck a dick. Like suck like ten dogs. I'm okay with that. Just go die. Don't care. Okay, we're at level six. Alt swipe. You know it's gonna be really really helpful because I'm gonna want to catch like as many Pokemon as possible because chances are I'm gonna get stuck. Oh, I get double stab. Yes. Yes, I'm okay with this. Okay, we're getting rid of Roar. I'm never gonna use you. Ever. Ever. Like, who who uses Roar? Like, unless later on in the game and someone's setting up like eight swords dances and like seven evasives, then I don't care. We beat Kanyan, that's fine. Unbelievable. Um, I'm sorry, but I've beaten you like nine times in uh Gen 6, so um yeah. Guys, Kanyan again, he's a really good friend of mine, so obviously I'm gonna be talking crap to him. I'm pretty sure he'll talk crap to me if, uh, I, I don't know, I'm pretty sure he would talk crap. That's just what we do. We talk shit. It's just how life is. Let's go talk to Mama. Let's heal off real fast. Uh, Mama. Mama, I got a boo-boo. I need you to uh, give me a band-aid and a uh, bowl of ice cream, because I'm horribly injured. I mean, my weeping bell has it worse, but I should get the uh, ice cream. All right, let's go. Let's go get our items. So I'm gonna make this a really short video. So our objective for today is grab Oak's parcel, take it to Oak, and get our first, uh, get our first friend. Okay, Curlia, mm, I might catch you. Just, I mean, I, don't, I obviously I can't catch it yet, but that, that's perfectly okay. Whatever. So anyway guys, I'm, again, I'm really, really excited for Sun and Moon. I don't know about you guys, but I'm picking Rowlet. It's Final Evolution Decidueye. Its typing is awesome. Its art, its design, awesome. Its move pool is pretty awesome. Pretty much everything about that bird is freaking legit. And apparently Sacred Fire is Stealer of Souls. But, guys... I do not under I don't think any of you understand how excited I am. Um, I will openly admit I have been keeping up with the leaks and Ugh. Ugh, guys I'm so sorry that I just yawned, but I'm keeping up with the leaks and the guy who got a hard copy and he's been like leaking all kinds of shit, I've definitely been keeping up on that. I haven't been reading everything. But I've been reading a lot of it, and there's a lot of awesome stuff to just make this game even cooler. I mean, I was already pumped, but they keep throwing, like, just the greatest shit ever at us. Okay, another Kurlia, you know, go die. I do not care. Anyway, sun move. Uh, guys, battling red and blue, that's awesome. Being able to team up with previous champions, that's legit. Uh, four versus four Pokemon battles, that's nice. New typings, new video, I mean, new move pools, new abilities, tons of new Pokemon. This is, the sad thing is, I honestly think Gen 7 is going to be way better than Gen 6. And Gen 6 was pretty freaking awesome. I honestly think, like, the best thing that Gen 6 produced for us 
was Mega Evolution, and let's, let's, let's list off all the things Gen 7 is offering us. No more HMs, so no need for HM slaves. Z moves. All of your starters get Z moves. Awesome new abilities, way bigger in list of new Pokemon introduced. Um, you get a broken ass Greninja. Let's see, um, you get to team up with previous champions. I'm pretty sure I already mentioned that, but it's still freaking awesome. Uh, you pretty much got like a mini Pokemon Snap in your game. That's already like seven, eight freaking legit features coming into this new game. So. That's awesome. Uh, I don't know if you're allowed to sit in Generation 7 because I was playing the demo and I wanted to sit down because... Okay, that's the second greatest thing Generation 6 brought us, was the ability to finally sit down. But at least in the demo, you can't sit. It's kind of annoying and you have to push the 8 button. But you know what? I'm totally willing to live without those. Totally willing. Yeah, I came from Palatown. Yeah, I know Professor Oak. We pretty much live in the same tiny ass town. Just, just give me the package. Just, I, ju I just want to go. I want to go. I want to get this journey started. So, yeah. I'm, I'm willing to live without the sitting and having to push A. I mean, guys, no more HM slaves. I don't think you understand how happy I am about this. I hate, 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 hate playing a game. And like, oh, I need this HM in order to progress. Shit. I have to go back to the day... Not the daycare, the Pokemon Center. To pull out a Pokemon to teach an HM. I don't want my main party party to have all these HMs and shit. No. Garbage. Alright, let's drop this off pretty fast. Yeah. It's definitely growing attached to me. I've been, like, eating the souls all day. Like, I don't think you understand. This is my life. I am your king. And here comes Kanyan, blah blah blah. Of course you can forget. You're like a 90 year old man. The Pokedex, mm, I really... Does anyone even use the Pokedex? Like, be honest, do you guys use the Pokedex? Thank you for your shit-ass device, but that's okay. Um, okay guys, uh, real talk. Uh, Professor Oak and Professor Sycamore are probably my favorite professors. Oh, and Juniper. But, besides one. Anyway, so we finally got our Pokeballs, we can finally start catching Pokemon. Yeah, you're too old to get the job. What happened to all of your other Pokemon? Did they just die? Is that why you only have three? Well, not one because two little, two little snot those brass decided to go on a Pokemon adventure. And if you read the manga, there's a third one who comes in and steals the third Pokemon. So, I wonder if that was the predecessor for your rival in Gold and Silver. So... We finally are able to start our journey, so let's see if we can run into something awesome. Um, da, 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 da. Oop, we got a battle. Alright, I, I, can, I can handle a Smeargle. I'm, I'm okay with that. Uh, it could be worse. Uh, I actually don't even know what that ability... Oh, you know Fall Swipe too. Well, you suck a dick. So we're gonna use False Light because I definitely want to catch this. I want it because I need friends, I need a team, and let's grab it really fast. Let's wait, oh, alright. It's fine. Thunder. Uh -uh. You ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. Guys, I'm sorry if I sound like lackluster. I'm actually kind of tired of it really lazy to me. And yes, we can get ourselves our Smeargle. I kind of want to name it, but if I don't name one, I can't name the rest of them. Give a nickname to Smeargle? No. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'll hopefully be uploading more videos for this Let's Play like really, really soon. And there's something really weird going on with my file, just so you guys know. So I'm going to try to figure out what's going on with that so I don't have to keep restarting the game and doing stupid shit. So guys, thank you again so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the future. Alright, hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye-bye!